questions. It's more like I call it the money question is like for an organization, for a leader, what processes that they should implement for their team, perhaps, or like for their organization so that like, you know, like this again, like, you know, if you can do the same way bullet points, one, two or three, and to say like, what can they do to improve their empathetic work culture? Uh, that would be fantastic. Well, so like the definition of empathy, right? Accurate understanding. The first mm -hmm. thing to do is to try to understand what's going on. Um, you know, if people are leaving your company, you should be doing exit interviews. You should be doing retros. You should be like trying before you come in with like a workshop or like a, um, you know, I don't know, some sort of band-aid solution, like try to get accurate understanding and leadership that cares and invests that time that's going to go a long way. Um, I would even go so far, and this is a little bit idealistic, but to, to people that have left the company a long time ago, like just like do a retro on your processes, like do an assessment, take stock of what's going on um, before you try to address it. Um, and, you know, that, that doesn't have to be, um, interviews either you can use tools like empathic and other tools where they do conversation analysis and email and like you can get a sense of how you're behaving now and what you need to improve and really get like a detailed outline of that um, the main thing though to keep in mind for those type of assessments is sometimes what happens in leadership is that they use them then to like hire people or like they uncover mm -hmm. problems and it doesn't actually foster learning and skill building and understanding. It just becomes like another mechanism to like improve efficiencies. So I would also say like number two would be to invest in training. And mm -hmm. if you really want to work on retention, like in, invest in those top performers and helping them and um, empowering them to continue to help others, but also invest in the people that are coming in and learning and maybe making mistakes. Like how can you provide space for them to like talk about these things? Like